This again is another story I love. I love, I love the story. This is one from Edward Farrick, a collect of this one. I went to see a man last night at Glen Chass to get some fairy tales, but his stories was but very short and many of them you have heard already. He was telling me about the two young men that came to the window and saw the fairies eating the cowrie, porridge in other words, and spitting in the dish to fill it again. Mm. What happens is that the two farm boys are coming home at night, they've been out for the night, and they look in the window. We now know where this farmhouse is. We, I was reading this the other week. We know where this farmhouse is. It's in Glen Chass. It's, it's Tom Fay's house at Glen Chass. They look in the window and their supper's been left out for them. They see the fairy. The bowl goes down, the fairy spit it. And it fills up again. So you've got a choice. And we can have a little test here. This is the tests, test moment here. What do you do? Do you eat the porridge or do you leave the porridge? Who would eat the porridge? Put your hand up. Who wouldn't eat the porridge? <laughs> Bad move. <laughs> the one that would not eat it died very soon afterwards. Torch is all I know and you still know nothing. <laughs> Told you the fairies give us a guidelines for life. They give us a moral compass for life. You turn down a gift from the fairies. Of course you're going to be punished. <laughs> you're also willing to waste food. You're going to waste food. 